guys, I am back with another video. If you don't know, my name is Jasmine Monet and I would love you to subscribe to your girl's channel. This is a what I want for Christmas video. This is my Christmas wish list for 2024. I do want to do a disclaimer. Listen, there's homeless people out there. You really should be giving back, you know. This is just a wish list. This is just what I would like to have for Christmas. You guys want to add this to your wish list? Here you go. So these are going to be things that I don't own. Um, some things that's been in my car on my phone for a minute now. And I'm just like, I, I, I want that. I, I want that for Christmas. First thing I'm going to start off with is a Telfer bag. If you don't know, a Telfer bag is this bag with like this E on it and it's actually black owned and I actually think it's black women owned as well. We love it, don't we? And I don't own one of these bags. My sister owns two, I believe. And I know so many people who have these bags and I actually really like it. And I have my um, Apple laptop and I really wanna start going to cafes, editing, my videos like have phase and I just think it would be so cute to have my tougher bag with my with my laptop you know my coffee sit and edit at a coffee shop you guys you you, you see the vision that's the vision so I really want a tougher bag I really don't have a color which one I like I really like the regular black one I think black goes for everything so I would love to just get a black one and then maybe a pop of color one I've seen this pink one online. I don't know if it was fake or not. And I don't know if they... Oh, they actually do sell baby pink one. That's really, really cute. Um, and so, yeah, I would really like a Telfer bag for Christmas. Next, we're going with Coach. I absolutely have grown to be obsessed with Coach ever since last year. And I have my Coach uh, Natala bag, 19 bag, that I am absolutely obsessed with and i swear i'm gonna coach at least once a week just going on there seeing what's new seeing what they have i'm like literally obsessed with coach um and i really want to coach wallet for my coach bag i want to coach wallet um of course i would use the coach wallet in other bags but i use my coach bag 95 percent of the time so I really want a coach wallet. They're really not that expensive. I think the cheapest coach wallet is like $25. So it is cheap in a way. But I don't know. I just still haven't bought myself one. But I, I would like a coach wallet. Also a coach bag. I could throw that in there. I would like a coach bag too. But I would like a coach wallet. Yeah. Next is a camera so i told myself if i hit um what 1500 i would get myself a new camera um i thought i would hit 1500 before the new year i don't know i think i'm at 20 1200 right now so we'll see but i really want a new camera i have the sony zx1 camera and i really do love this camera this is a great camera because i had the canon uh, the camera vlogging camera before and I was not a fan of it. Honestly, I think I got a defect camera Because um, the camera just was the quality was horrible um, But I, my best friend had the camera Boston in your room But my best friend had the camera and she loved the camera, but mine was just horrible But the camera that she actually just got is the DJ one pocket three camera and oh my god i want that camera so bad i literally edited it in my cart once i seen someone filmed a video with it like on tiktok see so once someone film a video with this camera and then after that I was like oh i need this camera instantly added it to my cart and then i talked to her and she was like i just bought that camera and i'm like i'm jealous i'm so jealous I really, I really, really want that camera. Ooh, that's kind of expensive. Now, this is the third one, but they clearly have three of them. So, I could get one of, like, the less cheaper ones. But the third one that they just came out with is decent, decent. Because I swore I seen the other ones before and I was like, eh. The third one is decent, decent. So, 
I wouldn't mind getting the third one. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe if I hit 2,000. So make sure you subscribe. So this is something that I wouldn't buy for myself. I'll, everything else I would actually buy for myself. So just putting that out there. This is something that I would not buy for myself. But if someone gifted me this, I would absolutely love it. Skims. I've never been a Skims girly. Clearly, I have absolutely nothing from Skims. My big sister loves Skims. And I really want something from Skims. But I just refuse to buy anything from Skims. Skims. Why am I saying skin? Skims. Which is, if you don't know, Kim Kardashian clothing line. Um, I would love to buy something from skims but yeah i wouldn't i wouldn't buy it myself but their basics just look so cute and their loungewear is just oh uh, would thrive because one thing about me i love me some good loungewear nice pair of sweatpants cute top i thrive in so i would really love something from skims if you want to give me something for skims honestly i'm not picky because i would love anything from skims so you can give me anything anything basic or whatever I would actually love. Also, in the Kardashian Jenner family, anything from Kai. Well, not anything from Kai. Kai jackets are really, really cute. If you see Kylie's jackets, like those big puffer jack leather jackets, one thing about me, if you know me, I love a, I love me a good leather jacket. I love me a good leather jacket. I have about three. I love me a leather jacket, and her cropped leather jackets are just so freaking cute but also i would never actually buy that myself actually i'm not even sure how much her jackets are let's see i did look on her website though i remember looking at her website and trying to see how much it is but i don't think i looked at the prices but let's see because let's see how much it is i know it's expensive because of course kylie jenner uh $128. Well, no, $119. Mm, I don't know. That's still too expensive for me. I'm not going to lie. It's kind of expensive. But I really do like her jackets. Like, even not just the cropped ones. Like, all of her jackets. The puffer ones. Oh, I'm obsessed with the puffer jackets. They're so freaking cute. Yeah, so if you got me a jacket from Kylie, I would also love that. I have like a whole bunch of stuff saved in my Walmart cart. I really just want, I'm redoing my living room, like adding stuff to it. So I got new couches, dining, um, so I got new couches. I got a new living room set, um, a living room table, side table, um, got myself this new desk. I'm going to get rid of the old one, um, I put these pictures up here, um, just adding some home decor. So honestly, any type of like cute home decor, if you want to give me a gift card to Home Goods or oh TJ Maxx or oh my God, also some speaking of TJ Maxx because I just went there last weekend. Honestly, anything from Juicy Couture, I am a, a I am obsessed with Juicy Couture. Mind you, I really don't have any. I don't think I have anything from Juicy Couture. I used to have this Juicy Couture wallet, but I don't even use it. But their bags, Juicy Couture is coming back. But I've always loved Juicy Couture. Their bags, their cute little wallets. Oh my God, a Juicy Couture tracksuit. That's actually what I was looking for when I went to TJ Maxx. Well, I went there for makeup organizers, but. When I got there and I seen how much Juicy Couture stuff they actually have, I was looking for the Juicy Couture. Um, why is my chair spinning? <laughs> I was looking for the Juicy Couture tracksuit, but they didn't have it. So, but they also had a Juicy Couture robe, which I really, really was contemplating on getting. I think it was only like $16.99. So, honestly, I kept telling myself, if I go back to TJ Maxx, I'm getting the robe. Like me, you know me, I live in my robe. I live in my robe. When I'm home, I'm in, my, I'm in that robe 80% of the time. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. 
Also, I'm going to put out this year, I would not be doing Vlogmas. I've done Vlogmas for maybe like the last three, four years. I've done Vlogmas a few times. And as much as I love vlogging every day, my life, I just feel like, is in shambles. <laughs> well, let me, not, let me not say that. <laughs> my life is not in shambles. But you know what? I just... And my life is just all over the place and I'm not going to be able to vlog as much as I would like to vlog. And so I don't want to start Vlogmas and then not finish. You know what I'm saying? But I do really want to vlog more and just film more, post more videos. So that is the goal. So I'm doing this video and I actually just last night sat down and wrote a bunch of ideas for videos that I really want to film. So I'll be posting out a lot of videos this December, although I won't be posting every day. I'll try to hit maybe twice a week if I can, for sure once a week, but I'm going to try. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure you give it a thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!